Okay guys, here we are. We're going to work the arms in this next four minutes. Shoulders, biceps, triceps, chest as well. So they're going to feel it. Now if you've got some dumbbells, some light dumbbells, then you're more than welcome to use them for a couple of the exercises we've got in here. Otherwise, get yourself ready. Four minutes starting in three, two, one. And all we're doing to kick off with really, really simple arm circles. Just going forwards. Small circles. Really, really easy. And it starts off easy, but this is going to get tough. I promise you that. When we get to the 30 second mark, I'm going to go the other way. Three, two, one. Flip it back in reverse. A few birds flying around the garden today. Looking for some food, probably. So right about now, they should start to feel a little bit like they're burning. Your shoulders, that is. Still going. Checking the time. All right, our next exercise, just for 30 seconds, is press-ups. We're going down to the ground. Now, I'm going to try and bang out as many press-ups as you can. Keep your head up, back straight, show it from the side. Breathe out as you push up. Rigid line through the ankle, hip, and shoulder. Nearly there. Three, two, one. Now you're up on your feet, and this is where you can use dumbbells if you've got some. All you're going to do is push up overhead and back down. This sort of tempo, nothing too crazy. Keep your hands in a fist if you want to. The so shoulder should be feeling it. Still feeling a little tender, a little sore maybe. Quick check of the time, five seconds left. I'm gonna go floor dips on this next one. So you're down on the ground. This is running clock, so we don't wanna hang about here. Down on the ground, butt up, and you're just gonna drop your butt down to the ground, let it kiss the ground and back up. Now this doesn't seem like a lot, but if you keep going, squeeze those triceps as you push up, you're gonna feel it. And this is a, a substitute really for people who are, I don't know, I haven't got a bed, a chair, or something like that in their room, and they can't do the full dips. Whew. Quick check, that's it. All right, back on the press-ups, here we go. I'll then side them for you. Here we go. And try and stop your head from dipping down as you drop down. A common mistake is this. Head drops here. If you want to keep looking out in front. There we go. Back up. We have bicep curls now. And if you've got those dumbbells, grab them now. We're going to bring your arms up and down. As if you've got a bar in your hand up on the side. The key to this though is not just going through the motion like this. That's you squeeze your biceps as you pull them up. So it's an act of rest really. And we're gonna go back on those tricep dips to finish. So on the floor, I squeeze these biceps. All right, last one. Hit the ground, let's go. Just let the butt drop down to the ground. Bring them up, squeeze those arms. Back of the arms with triceps. Nearly there now. A few more seconds. Come on, keep pushing. Ah, and there you go. So that's it, four minutes on the arms. A couple of easy ones in there for you, but if you've got a couple of pairs of dumbbells, and even if you haven't got some dumbbells, you can use something in your house or anything that's lying around, depending where you are, work, hotel room, whatever. There's always something you can pick up and use in place of dumbbells. And if you can't, then just do what I did there. All right, have fun. See you next time.